Okay, Red Lantern's main people. Oh, Evan, would you stop that? Every peep we make brings us bad luck. I have it bad enough already. Please, just leave the poor old woman be. I don't know if we can actually see her inside or not. Oh, is that her? Oh, there she is. She's having a bad time. Then again, like everybody's having a bad time. Especially these dogs. They can't even fight back. But they are worth good souls. So I don't really, uh, don't really mind doing it. Fun fact, if you didn't get the tonsil stone before, you'd get it right here, because Patches would be in that building instead. Doing Patches stuff. That's actually where I found it my first playthrough, now that I remember. Piece of candy. Eh, blood pellets. It's like getting a piece of Halloween candy that you just don't like. You're like, eh, I could do without it. You'll take it anyway. You might even eat it anyway, but it's not your favorite. I'll take bullets all day, though. Bullets and blood. Everybody loves bullets and blood in their Halloween basket. It's such a good analogy. Where the fuck am I going? I think I need to be above to make real progress, so I'm gonna try... Wait, no. Um... It's like... It's like some people in here. Throw it at me. Yeah, these guys die instantly to fire, which is why that guy's up there. But... We'll skip that and go to this last part over here instead. Which is so short... Oh, wait, no, there's something. It doesn't open from this side. So I'll have to come back for that. Alright, let's go up. Now, if I remember, there's just, like, a bunch of dudes up ahead. Yeah, there's something... There's something with this gate. There's something with that goddamn gate. What about a path that I almost skipped? Neat. I didn't know there was something back here. I didn't... I don't remember this at all. Is that death or a boss fight? I can't actually tell. I'm assuming... Mark, if you're still there, I'm assuming that's death. But it sure as fuck looks like a boss fight. Is this something special? This... Is this DLC? Did I miss this the first time I played? Or is this new? Oh, that's poison. Huh. Interesting. Oh, here I am. Let's see what these guys are about. Eh, ah, they're not too bad. They drop good stuff. Hey, Ian, Matt. Ooh, he 
beacons are, I have two big hits. Does this lead to the DLC? Oh, what the fuck are these things? Christ. Oh god, they're just giant leech worm things. And there's a bunch of them. Oh, okay. I've never been there. Alright, well. We'll come back to this in a minute. I've never been to y Yosefka's clinic, so that... This is it, very interesting to me. Before we do this, we have to do finish up a few things in the Forbidden Woods. Nice. The content I've never seen, I appreciate that. It's literally the reason I'm going through this again, is for the stuff I never saw. So close to one shot I am. Ooh, might trick. Mad crows. So I need to find this so my current goals are to find the suspicious beggar and defeat the shadow of Yarnum, and then take the hidden path. So that's that's my current list for this area. Oh, doggos. That's what I'm doing. Wow! That dog got fucked. I didn't even mean it. I didn't even mean it. Just kind of got in the way of my sword. What's up? I was trying to do a cool thing and didn't work out. Yes, the part you could never get to. Shit now. Profile. Regular shards. How lame. Beast roar. Is that magic? You roar and things go flying. Maybe one day I'll do a magic run of this, but not for a, not for a good bit, I think, if ever. Oh man, this poor horse! I didn't notice it the first time. I thought it was just a rubble, but no, that's a horse's body on fire somehow. They like really put some effort into it. Make sure that horse is on fire. I think you'd keep your horse for many things. And horses have many uses, in fact. It's like they're work animals or something. Up. Up. I think these guys are a little bit smarter. They're using oil, but they're lighting it on fire first, before hitting me with it. I would have had a much harder time earlier if they all did that, <laughs> instead of just throwing me- throwing oil on me. Now the question is, where is... Suspicious Beggar? We gotta find him. Where's he at? Is he up here somewhere? I've been looking out for red lanterns, but I haven't seen any. Okay. 
Oh, these guys aren't that bad. You just don't get close to them. Oh, do not even slow down here. Nice. Dead. Look at him hiding in the lock. Oh, damn it. I actually didn't see him. He looked like a stone. He had blood, though, so that makes up for it. What are you guarding, a corpse? He's guarding his own blood vials, is what he's guarding. And he did a bad job. Oh, this is the shortcut, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So that's open. Why don't we do another quick once over? Where's that bigger? That building is empty. I don't know if I can get into the bit this building. I think I can. Oh, oh, come on. Yep, not here. This one? We can get to this one. Hmm. Maybe he's up ahead. I'll glance at it before we go into the next area. Just to make sure we don't miss him. I know there's another row of buildings soon. With a fun surprise. Hasn't happened yet. Kind of expected it to. This guy doesn't know how to aim. He's like, he was shooting at the ground, effectively. Hoping it hit me. Oh. Did he whisper stranger? Or did someone else whisper stranger? I'm a stranger, and I'm looking for someone to talk to. Eh, I guess it was the dying guy. Oh, there it goes. Fucking artillery. I forget if it fires if I'm not in visible sight. Cat. Come on. She keeps getting in front of the TV. She knows. Alright, we're just gonna deal with this. How do you even get it to do that? That's crazy. He made the explosion force lesser on command. That's quite a talented uh, artilleryman right there. Man, he could have been somebody. Instead, he was a crazy peasant. Cat wants to know is why I won't pay attention to her. She's now pacing in circles on top of me. Oh. Okay. Hmm. I haven't checked this side too much. Nope, that's a corpse. What the fucking blood, though? Oh my god. Good blood. Very good blood. Is he this way? He's somewhere. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna check because I know that's. It's not quite a scene transition, but it's something different.
Actually, we're going to be back in just a second. Sorry about this. Okay, we're back. Looks like this dude is ahead of us, somewhere. So we're just gonna keep on moseying forward. I wanna say that's not him, but... I'm pretty sure he's just a regular looking NPC somewhere. down an elevator first. Not too worried about it. Well, that guy doesn't have very good hearing. Vaguely remember. Weird snake thing. Well, that explains why it was so obvious, and why the game seemed to focus on that one enemy. No. I guess it's gonna be a while before we see that guy. And that's fine. I don't think we need to see him right away. Hmm. Why do I have the feeling I'm missing something? I feel like there's something I've missed. We didn't, I guess we didn't go up and up here. Is there even an up? Uh, that doesn't 
seem to lead anywhere. There is an upper floor, for sure. Let's see, we came through here. Oh, yeah, nothing over there. Came around here. We did see this. But this is just a drop. Oops, that's not real. Well, now we're here. Our path has been chosen for us. Oh, no, that's death. Oh, never mind. The ladder it is. I feel like there's a shortcut up here. I don't know. Vague memories at this point. Very vague memories. Oh, this is pretty cool, though. Walking around on cogs. Very Castlevania y. Fortunately, they're not moving because that would probably be. Probably have some weird interactions in this game. No poison knives. Hey. Are you, oh, you're the Blimey. dude. Blimey. Don't scare me like that. On a night like this, I took you a monster. <laughs> oh, thank the stars, you're fairly normal. Was it you who put down that awful beast? Ooh, that thing had me trembling, frozen in my boots. And then you came along. So well, apparently we have to send hunter, this guy to your Sepphicus clinic. Would you know of any safe havens? Because he seems to be a bad man. I'll be. Thank you. It's about time I made a move. I wonder. I can't very well stay out on my own. Oh, you're giving me hope. Terribly kind of you. Take this. It's all I can offer us, thanks. Hmm. Interesting. Thank you. Except I can't very well. Alright. Uh, I wonder what happens if you send him to the chapel. Does he just kill everyone? Okay, now we're gonna go kill the Shadow of Yarnum. So I guess we do have to clear this whole section. This whole area. Alright. Oh, hey! We can drop down over here. I almost forgot. Oh, fucking yeah, the cannon! Oh boy, we gotta try that at least once. Oh, I should kill him? Hmm. Apparently, we get to kill him later, so we're gonna kill him in the clinic. <laughs> Glancing at the wiki, though, apparently if we send him to the chapel, he slowly kills every other NPC over time. So that's neat. <laughs> this guy's a fucking psycho. Ah, uh, but no, we will, we will get the rune when we meet him in the clinic. So no worries. Aw, oh, almost fucked that up. So, all that's set, that means we have to go this way. Yep, we get a rune either way. Oops, what am I fucking... Overpower! 
sword's the best. I will always sing its praises. Oh, that's right, the shortcut's right here. It's, in, it's right there. Hey, stone shards. You know, we have a lot of souls, and I don't want, I don't feel like losing them. We should probably go spend them. And hello, sir. Ah, a new face. I, I don't am. know this guy. And an accomplished hunter, it would appear. <laughs> I am Volta, master of the League. Interesting. Members of the League cleanse the streets of all the filth that spread about during the hunt. Like any half-decent hunter ought to, you know? Haven't you seen enough of these wretched beasts, freakish slugs and mad doctors? Sentence these fiends to death. With the help of your League confederates. Is this a multiplayer what do you say? thing? Why not join the League? Ah. Uh, should I join the League? I don't remember this. Oh no. What's his name, Valtier? Okay, I guess we're just gonna join. Yes, as a hunter, well should. Commit this to heart. Our own Carol Rune, symbol of the League. Impurity, interesting. The night brims with defiled scum and is permeated by their rotten stench. Just think, now you're all set to hunt and kill to your heart's content. Yes, I am. In cooperation with your fellows, ah, your League is. Confederates. <laughs> it's some weird multiplayer thing. No, there is one thing you must know. By the oath of the League, those who bear its rune will see vermin. Vermin writhe deep within all filth and are the root of man's impurity. All vermin are to be crushed. The League exists to expunge all vermin, ridding us of any trace of human corruption. And so, until we are rid of all vermin, you must continue to hunt and kill. This bloody fate is ours alone. Huh. Do not expect the world to grasp our work. But remember... The Confederates will always have my blessing. And each other. Always. The League exists. All right, all right, all right. Do not expand. We got it, we got it. Interesting. So I guess new enemies will appear if we equip that rune. So we may as well. Something new. And hell, maybe it's a good rune. Should have at least enough for something.